Speaker, and good morning. <coughs> the proposed budget in education represents a two-edged sword of cuts. <coughs> two-edged, first of all, by the dwindling quality of education, and the second is the loss of jobs in our state. The university system is proposed to be cut 15.3%. This represents 3,200 jobs. Diminished quality, less jobs. The LEAs have been given a mandate, or will be given a mandate, to cut in discretionary fashion approximately 7,000 jobs. This would be a diminished quality of education and a loss of about 7,000 jobs. Cuts in support positions for the LEAs represent approximately 2,380 jobs. This would be cuts to counselors, nurses, media specialists, those who assist in an ancillary fashion with education. Teacher assistants in grades two and three will be summarily cut. This represents about 8,000 jobs. Couple that with the knowledge that many of these assistants double as bus drivers, and one wonders how we're gonna get the kids to school. The community college system will receive an additional $10 per credit hour in the first year, $12.50 for the second year. This expense will probably result in fewer students costing jobs, we estimated about $21,000. There will be a new fee for those who wish to take driver's ed, $75 per student. For families with multiple students, this represents a direct hit. Again, diminished quality of education, but most of all, in summary, around $21,000, jobs rather, just in education, 21000 that's a very significant figure. Good morning, everyone. 